Welcome back. A Memphis man becomes a random victim of crime and his family life is changed forever. You know, he survived being shot seven times, but his road to recovery has left his family and his finances on a rocky road. That's why their family friend reached out to us to pass it on. I want to pass it on to Georgia Finley and her husband Charles Finley because they both have been through a tremendous ordeal. Cynthia Anthony shares how her friend Georgia put everything on hold to help care for her husband George. Last November, a would-be robber shot him seven times after he stopped at the Five Star Express gas station in Fraser. Well, he was working, so now he, of course, he's not able to work. She's having to take care of him. So with all of that going on, I felt that the need to try to assist them in whatever way I could. Are you ready? We hand over the $600 and pass it on money to Cynthia. $300 from News Channel 3. And here's an additional 100, 200, 300 from our anonymous donor. We make the drive over to the Finleys. We're ready. And get ready to surprise Georgia. Is Cynthia? Oh, Georgia. How you doing? Can you step outside a minute? <laughs> yeah, I can step outside. Cynthia tells her why we're here. I got in touch with Channel 3, and what they did, they are giving you $300. Hold your hand now. There's 300 from Channel 3, and then there's another 300 from an anonymous person they gave. So we want this here to help assist you in whatever way it can. And I know you appreciate it. The kind gesture overwhelms Georgia. I'm sorry, I can't say nothing. Oh, God. Georgia explains how she'll use the pass it on money. Bills, because we're, we got $84,000 in medical bills. So, hey, it's going straight to bills. And that's, that's exactly what we need right now. She tells us Charles is now in physical therapy to get back on his feet, but will have to live with the trauma of being shot seven times. Doctors say he had 13 entrance and exit wounds. You know, every time you put a truck in gear, it locks, so. So he got in the truck and then they still shot him? Are they shot? Yeah, they shot through the truck. Cause I guess they got mad. I guess they were mad because they couldn't get him. That day changed the family's life forever. Georgia is now her husband's around-the-clock caregiver. She tells us what it means to have friends like Cynthia during this time. And it's been hard. It's been so hard. But when I tell you this a friend, this a friend right here. A friend that has stood by her side through one of the roughest times in her life. Friendship that'll last forever. And Mrs. Finley says police told her they captured someone, but she hasn't heard if they've been charged. She says they'd always talked about moving from Memphis, but since this has happened, she and her husband are motivated to do it sooner. Mm -hmm.